Welcome to the Raise with Jesus podcast, 10 minutes every day where the life of Jesus meets yours. In this episode, you have your Jesse Tree devotion for December 6th, and today's ornament is a stairway or a ladder. Here goes. A stairway in Jacob's dream. This is a story about Jacob, who was a trickster. One of Jacob's biggest tricks was fooling his twin brother Esau into trading the special family blessing for a bowl of soup. Later, when their father Isaac was dying, Jacob tricked him too by by pretending to be Esau. Now that Jacob had the special family blessing, Esau was furious. He wanted to kill Jacob. So Jacob ran away from home and headed for his uncle's house. He traveled for many miles, scared and lonely. One night, when the sun went down, he stopped to rest. He found a stone and used it as a pillow, and he lay on the ground and fell fast asleep. God knew that Jacob felt scared and lonely, and guilty, too, because of his tricks. So as Jacob slept, God sent him a wonderful dream. Jacob dreamed of a stairway that went from the ground all the way up to heaven. On that stairway, walking up and down, were angels. At the very top of the stairway was God himself. He said to Jacob, I am the Lord, the God of your grandpa Abraham and your father Isaac. Someday you will have a huge family and all this land will belong to you. And there is more. I am going to bless everyone on the whole earth through one of your great, 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 fill in the blank, grandchildren. Now remember, I am always with you and I will watch over you wherever you go. When Jacob woke up the next morning, he was so happy. He said, The Lord is right here in this place, and I didn't even know it. This place is awesome. It's the house of God, the gate of heaven. Jacob wanted to remember what God had said to him, so he took his stone pillow and turned it so that it stood up like a little pillar. Then he poured oil over it and gave that place a new name, Bethel, which means house of God. Do you know who Jacob's eventual grandson would be? the one that would be a blessing to the whole earth? Jesus. God promised Jacob that the Savior would be born in Jacob's own family. As I hang the stairway on the Jesse tree, here is an Advent promise for me. God promised Jacob that he would always be with him and that the Savior would be born from his family. That Savior is Jesus. Thanks so much for joining us here at the Raised with Jesus podcast. Please be sure to tune into church today or attend church locally, wherever you happen to be. If you don't happen to live near a church, check out the show notes and that link yearbook.wells.net at the very top of the show notes will direct you to a nearby church. Or if you're not able or comfortable to attend church right now, uh, tune into our YouTube page at Resurrection Mommy. Just go to bit.ly slash R-E-L-C YouTube, and that'll also be in the show notes. Thanks so much for joining us. God bless your day.